Welcome back to the Gnome Show, everyone. I'm Josh, your humble host, and it's my duty and my pleasure to trawl the briny depths of YouTube so that I may bring you the shinies. I cover short films of varying genres, video games, analog horror, and sci-fi, and anything else that I think is groovy. I hope you'll enjoy tonight's offerings, content for the blood god, and on with the show. Tonight, we have Static. A psychological horror short film by Macabre Productions. I have not uh, seen this before because it, I am not sub to them. Uh, so, yeah. Um, how has your week uh, been, um, Mr. Bravo? Everything okay? Um, I see you saying you're doing good, but like, like really, how's your how's your week been going? Um, and everybody out there. As you um, I hope everything was um, peaceful, profitable, productive, all of those things. Um, we can all use some some good karma, you know. Let's check. So Charlotte, I think we made some good progress last week during our EMDR session. Today I'd like to dig a little deeper into processing the memories in the weeks leading up to October 5th. I want you to visualize what you were doing the first time you heard the voice. I remember I was making dinner. I think it was anything, just interference from another radio signal, maybe. Okay. I understand. Now, I want you to think about the very first time you felt any concern when you heard the voice. Go with that feeling. Are you ready?
What the fuck? Mom. Hi, sweetie. Hi. You're not still sleeping, are you? You know it's noon. Uh, yeah, the baby kept me up all night. Oh, poor thing. And you tried the new formula I sent you? Yes, Mom, but that's not it. He just won't stop crying. He keeps me up, like, day and night. Hey, I was just looking at flights last night. I think I should come out and help you out just for a bit. I know with Evan gone now, you need some help. Well, I can do it myself, OK? Um. Look, I, I gotta go. I gotta go check on him. Okay, sweetie. Call me later, please, so we can talk about it more. I know you've been busy, but I feel like we haven't had a real conversation. <sighs> okay, I'll talk to you later. I love you. I love you, too. Bye. I don't understand why you didn't have your mom come over and talk. so fucking sad too because she's Stayed up and watched him all fucking night. Do it. So is this uh, like her postpartum? Is this postpartum depression?
Charlotte, you remember what I showed you? You didn't kill your baby. He died. He suffocated on a blanket while he was sleeping. Remember? It wasn't your fault. You were asleep. There was nothing you could have done to save him. It was an accident. The body is in the moment he died. No one could have known. Mm -hmm. Productions that was fucking wonderful and terrifying and tragic and sad all at once. Wow. Um, tell me what you thought down in the comments. Um, make sure you follow Mako Bray Productions. Um, let's see. Yeah, they've got a they've got a couple other short films uh, for you to look at, um, so go do that. Uh, and uh, as for me, like, share, subscribe, follow, all that kind of good stuff. It helps me out tremendously. Um, have a good night, sir. Um, um, and um, yeah, I hope you have a great night. Be safe, happy, and healthy. And I love you all. And I'll see you in the next one.